Hey guys, Bad067 here, back for another video. Today I'm here on my free, that was a fail. Today I'm here on my free roam world, and uh, yeah, I actually wanted to switch it up a little bit. I haven't done one of these uh, little videos where I kind of discuss stuff in a while. I tend not to do them too often, but I kind of end up doing them every now and again just because I have new stuff to tell you guys and important stuff I think you guys should know. So I do recommend you stick around for the entire video because there is a lot of important stuff to talk about. A lot of it is series-based. So I just want to throw it out there, you know, my Batman series will be talked about in this, as well as some other stuff. So if you're interested in that, which I know a lot of you guys are, I do recommend you stick around for the entire video because there's lots of stuff to talk about. Uh, anyway, I did want to start off by saying something that's not series related. However, I do want to apologize for it. I actually missed my channel anniversary. And uh, really quickly, I just want to say, guys, thank you so much for three years on YouTube. Um, I've just been so busy trying to plan out my different series and just get stuff done for you guys as well. Uh, around that time, it was February 1st. February 1st was actually my channel anniversary. And um, around that time, my exams had just recently ended. And I was really trying to get that Batcave video out to you guys. So honestly, I just forgot about it and I apologize for that I had some people actually remember in the comments which is great to see I can't believe some of you guys actually remember my channel anniversary that's like remembering my channel's birthday that's crazy so thank you guys so much for the people who remembered and um, overall just uh, thank you guys so much for three years on YouTube and all the support you guys have given me I want to make sure you guys know that you are appreciated I want to make sure that you guys always know that you're appreciated here on the channel and um, yeah anyway like I said thank you guys so much for three years on YouTube and here's the many more. Um, anyway, I would like to move on to the important stuff now. Uh, not that that wasn't important, but I do have some stuff that uh, I do have to discuss. So uh, first thing I want to talk about, number one, is my Island series. If you guys remember that, I showed a little preview at BatsCon. That is going to be postponed. It's not going to be canceled. It's just not going to be happening right now. Uh, pretty much, I've just got a lot on my plate, guys. I've got my Batman series, I've got the Adventures, I've got the Hunt for Vengeance, which I'm doing with my friends. It's just, it's a lot. And um, it may not seem like a lot, because there's only three things, but, I mean, to think about it, that's like three different stuff I have to work on. I know the Hunt for Vengeance, once I'm done that, you know, that's done and over with. But uh, I still do have my Batman series and the Adventures, and those are both things that I actually need to make uh, full episodes for with my friends helping me, and that's a lot. Um, with the island, it would be very similar. I had to get friends on, and you know, I'd have to do episodes, like full-on episodes, and it would be crazy. So that's that's honestly something that's kind of a bit of a problem. And um, yeah, so I just don't want to have another thing on my plate that I have to worry about. And honestly, in terms of interest for me, in terms of interest for you guys, I know that not a lot of people seem like they were interested in doing this series. And I am kind of interested in doing it, but right now my main focus is on my Batman series and the adventures, and that's pretty much how it's kind of going right now. The island is just kind of in the back of my head and um, I don't really want to have to think about it right now. I don't want to have to stress myself out any more than I already do because I know I promised you guys I'd do it but uh, yeah it didn't seem like much people were excited for it so I'm just gonna say right now um, if any of you guys were, were excited for it I apologize but I can bring it back at any time. I'm not saying it's cancelled I'm just saying I'm not doing it right now and I'm sure a lot of you guys would prefer for me to focus more on my Batman series, which is what I've been doing, because that's what really I want to focus on, and um, yeah, so that's one thing. Um, on the topic of my Batman series, I did want to talk about how the format was going to work for the series. I am changing it a little bit because um, I just I wasn't really um, happy with how it was before. I was originally when I first made it, and I realized that I kind of wanted it to be a little bit different. So I'm going to run this idea through you guys, and hopefully you guys like it. Um, so the old Bruce Wayne thing, you know, Bruce Wayne looking back on his time as Batman, that sort of thing, that part can still be used. I might use that near the end of the series, if anything. If not, I'll use it for a short movie or something else that I might want to do. Uh, but besides that, I'm going to use the idea at some point. So uh, that part's still going to be sticking around on the channel one way or another. And I'm not going to confirm that's going to be the ending of my series, because that would be giving you guys the ending of my series. But I'm just not going to use it right now. I'm just probably going to use it later on. Um, but anyway, how my series is going to work, I would rather it be, instead of just having, you know, old Bruce Wayne reflecting on his time as Batman with each episode uh, kind of just sort of focusing on one main villain each episode, and, uh, you know, even, not even main villains, there were a lot of other villains that were in there, like there were some minor ones like Killer Moth and, and Man Bat and all those villains um, that aren't as big or well known. 
However, I just kind of decided that I would really like to have a series where I wouldn't just have one episode for each villain. Like some episodes, um, you know, obviously villains like the Joker and Two-Face and Penguin and all them, uh, a lot of the bigger ones deserve a lot more than one episode. And then there's some of the smaller villains that don't really need a whole episode based off them. And each episode was going to be kind of like, you know, you'd show the origin, show maybe a notable crime that they've done or just one that I made up, and uh, how they, you know, they're kind of reign of villainy ended I guess you know if they died they quit being a villain whatever uh, whatever happened to them and that would kind of be how each episode would go um, I could still use this idea in the future but for now I really want to focus on something of more of a story I want to be able to create story arcs I want to be more creative and I want to treat it almost kinda of like a show I guess but like you know uh, as much as I can get on Minecraft, but I still want to kind of treat it a little bit more like a show. And what I mean by that is, like, if you guys watch, you know, um, Flash or Arrow, uh, which I do, amazing shows, uh, you would know, just for a comparison, um, obviously you have the main storyline. You have, you know, you have Zoom or Damien Dark or whatever. That's the, the main villains that are on uh, in these current seasons of the shows. And, um, you know, you have those main storylines. And then every now and again, every couple episodes, uh, they take a break from that storyline. They go and maybe they fight uh, for Flash. It might be another metahuman that was affected by the particle accelerator, uh, which has nothing to do with Zoom at all. And then maybe every now and again, you'll have villains that Green Arrow will face that have nothing to do with Damien Dark. So that's kind of how I want my series to run. There'll be a main storyline, and that will take up most of the episodes of each season. And every now and again, um, let's say the main villain is Joker for the... Uh, you know, for the whole season, uh, th that's his sort of like story arc with Batman. Uh, if Joker is the main villain, then uh, what will happen is that every now and again, maybe Batman doesn't have information on what Joker's currently doing. Uh, Commissioner Gordon doesn't really have any information for him, but however, he does have some information on uh, some current, um, you know, maybe some arson or something like that uh, caused by Firefly, and that will be a little sort of like a, a sidetrack that Batman will do during the season. So every now and again, some of the minor villains or even like some of the major ones will come in and just kind of, you know, pop up for an episode or two just to kind of uh, take a break from the main story. And that's kind of how I want to run my, my series. So you got the main story, you got the main sort of... Um, storyline for the series or the season I should say not the series uh, main storyline for the season and then you've got little episodes in between that are just kind of like sidetracking and just kind of bringing in other villains that way you know each season is not just mainly focused on one villain or you know a few depending on what the storyline is and uh, you can bring in a few villains every now and again kind of like how TV shows do it so I figured that'd be kind of cool and uh, that way I can be more creative, I can make storylines, I can have a little more fun with it, and uh, each villain can get more than just one episode if I wanted them to. So I think that'd be a lot cooler, and um, as well, depending on how long the storyline is, it'll kind of depend on how long the seasons are. Like Joker, he might get um, maybe, who knows, maybe like 15 to 20 episodes. I'm not saying that's going to be for sure, I'm just saying that could be like a, you know, an estimate. Um, and maybe someone like, I don't know, maybe Killer Croc gets his own season. Uh, you know, his own little uh, mini-series or whatever, his, his own season storyline, he could have um, a smaller storyline, because obviously Joker's going to be a lot bigger storyline than Killer Croc, so he might get like six to ten episodes or something. So, like, that will give me a chance to do multiple seasons in a year. And it's not just to pump out seasons, it's just I'm more focused on the storylines. And uh, that way, I get multiple seasons out to you guys, and I can end up having a series by the end of the year with, like, three seasons. I'm not saying... Like, I, I could do that. I'm not saying I'm going to definitely have three seasons by the end of the year. But once again, it's just sort of an estimate. It's just something I could possibly do. So it kind of, you know, it's a little more fun. Um, it definitely sets up for a lot of creativity on my part. And uh, it definitely gives you guys a really cool series to watch, I think. You know, just watching everything and having multiple seasons with all these different storylines. And then in the end, if I want to have it so that Bruce Wayne's reflecting on all of this... I can totally make that happen. It's it's easily just, it, it could be kind of thrown in there at the end. It's something that I could possibly do. So I think that'd be really cool. I think that'd be a lot nicer. And it would be a little bit more of a Batman series, I think, to me. And, um, yeah. So anyway, that'll kind of be how the, uh, the series will run. Like I said, if there's any ideas you missed from how my old format was, I can always be sure to try to do that in uh, short movies or, or anything else I could possibly try to do. Uh, but yeah, that'll be my uh, my Batman series. Hopefully you guys enjoy that idea. Just let me know in the comment section below if you do. Um, anyway, so uh, next I want to talk about actually a sort of mini series I want to start, and this will be after the Hunt for Vengeance, because uh, you know obviously that's you know one of the big things on my plate right now. And uh, one th 
that's done, I want to move on to something else. I want to have a third little mini sort of series that I can do, and um, just kind of for fun. And I know you're probably thinking like, Bats, you're stressed out. Why are you adding something else uh, to your list of things you have to do? This is only going to be very small. It's not going to be huge. It's just going to be something I won't have to make episodes for, like long episodes, like 15, uh, 10 to 15 minutes long or even 20 minutes long. Um, it can easily just be sort of like, you know, a couple minute clips. What it's going to be, it's going to be, um, I'm going to be taking the animated series, Batman the Animated Series, and I'm going to be remaking small little clips from it, uh, just depending on some of my favorite clips personally. And uh, once I start the first few episodes, I'll let you guys in the comments actually just suggest clips to me. Uh, don't do it on this video just because it's not really necessary now and it's not really needed. But um, if you guys ever want to suggest clips to me in the future, that's totally cool. Uh, when I upload like the first couple episodes, uh, or should I say clips, it's not really a full episode. I'm not going to be doing full episodes because I think, like, I, I don't even know if I'm allowed to do that, like recreate the, an entire episode of the animated series. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to do that, but I, I know I can do clips, I'm pretty sure. So I probably will do that. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have like multiple clips. I've already had some planned that I really want to do. Um, a few in particular just off the top of my head are um, some scenes from Mask of the Phantasm, you know, Batman's First Night Out would be really cool, stuff like that. Um, there's also um, one I really want to do, me and Gotham Bat, my friend Gotham Bat have been talking about, is uh, one from Batman Beyond Return of the Joker, where Batman has his final confrontation with Joker, with Tim Drake, uh, you know, it's kind of like a, um, you know, kind of like a Joker Jr. It's really, honestly, probably one of my favorite animated movies by far. And just how twisted the whole storyline is. It's so amazing. I, I can't get over it. Like, even when I first watched it, uh, when I was young, I think that was one of the first times I was actually exposed to Batman was that movie. And I just remember seeing that that uh, sort of flashback scene and thinking it was so amazing, just so crazy as well. It was, it was very just, you know, blew my mind. So I just, I got to say, I would love to do that scene. Uh, with Batman and Joker, that'd be so awesome. Gotham Bat does an amazing Joker. He said he'd be definitely down to do it, and I'd be definitely down for doing it as well. Um, so yeah, really, really cool. I'll probably do little clips like that every now and again. I can't promise I'll have like one every month or anything, but uh, whenever I get some free time, if I'm ever between videos, I'm like, hey, I need something to do, I might do a little clip. Um, the only problem with that is the reason I won't do them like all the time is just because, uh, number one, I'll eventually run out of clips, most likely. Um, and number two is just because, you know, I had to build the sets for, like, the backgrounds and stuff for each of these. And some of them aren't easy, because some of them are, like, out in the city, and, you know, you get, like, a uh, view of, like, the whole city and stuff. And I'd have to actually try to make some of that, which would be very insane. So, you know, obviously I'll have to take time to make the sets, just kind of be a side project for me to do. Because every now and again, uh, everyone has it, you know, you get bored of building and uh, that'll just give me something else to build. You know, if I'm ever bored of building on my Gotham City, I'm, I can't really think of any ideas. If I keep forcing myself to build, I'm not gonna, you know, do anything. Uh, I just want to take a little bit of a break. I can go over there and just start building some buildings uh, from the scene, and that'd be pretty cool. So, um, I think that'd be really awesome, really fun. And uh, I'm not just limited to the animated series. I'm probably gonna end up doing uh, anything in that, you know, general universe. Uh, Batman Beyond, Justice League, if I have time. Uh, if you know I can get friends on to do a lot of those things, just like mini clips, pretty much. Uh, but obviously, if I expand from the animated series to Justice League and Batman Beyond, that'll probably come later. Um, but like I said, just clips, not full episodes. I think that'd be really cool. So, yeah, that's pretty much what I have planned uh, in terms of series-wise. Uh, new format for my Batman series. I've got the Island, which is going to be postponed, and I've got this animated series uh, sort of little clip. Uh, series. I don't really know what to call it yet. I'll probably think of a name. But yeah, so that's really all I wanted to talk about with you guys. Those are the three main things I really needed to get out to you guys. Hopefully you guys like my ideas. If you agree with what I was talking about here in today's video, uh, whatever it was about, please uh, let me know down in the comment section below. That'd be really helpful. And yeah, I actually do have one more surprise though. Uh, over here, I have three spots right here in my skin statue area. And I have three spots over here oh if you can let me get through the door come on alright there we go um, over here in my hall of super friends I had an upstairs area and uh, yeah so uh, in honor of three years on YouTube I wanted to give you guys something and I figured it'd be cool if I did a little giveaway and uh, what I'll be doing I'll be actually giving you guys a chance to win a spot here either in my skin statue area or 
over here in my Hall of Super Friends. The reason I'm giving away three for each is because, um, ironically, it's not because of three years on YouTube. I didn't plan that out. It just kind of like, I saw that there was three spots here. I decided to give them away. It had nothing to do with it. And then uh, three spots over here, I just wanted to make it even with, you know, how many spots were over here. But uh, pretty much, uh, for the people who have console editions, what I want you guys to do, uh, I want you guys to answer me a question, which is, um, even for the, everyone, everyone can answer a question to enter for either the Hall of Super Friends or the uh, Skin Statue area. All you have to do is answer a question and say what you like currently on the channel, whether it's upcoming like my Batman series or it's currently happening like my Gotham City stuff. And uh, you can name a few things. A few things would be more helpful, I guess. It'd probably give you a better chance, I'd say. And um, another thing that I want you guys to do, just say, I like, you know, whatever, whatever stuff you currently like on the channel. And tell me what you actually miss on the channel. Stuff, series that I stopped doing uh, that, you know, I just kind of ended. Uh, tell me what you miss. Now, the Adventures is still happening. Some people think it's it's ended now. No, it's it's still going on. So the Adventures is still going on right now. But I remember I only did one video of a Reading with Bats thing where I read an old story that I had uh, from when I was younger. And I said I could do more reading stories where I just make up random stories for you guys every now and again just kind of read them to you guys. If that's something you miss, let me know. I know a few people said they missed my Survival Series. Some people even said they missed Game Drop Weekend, which was back, like, during my first year of YouTube, I, I ended that like two years ago, and some people actually still are waiting for a new episode. I'm like, what? Like, it's, it's over. Like, what's happening? Um, so, yeah, um, pretty much, I just want you guys to answer that question. Just say, I like this on the channel, and then I miss this on the channel. And just list a few things for each. And, um, yeah, and for the people who are entering for the skin statue area, tell me what skin you would like. It can't be a custom skin. It has to be in these skin packs right here in any of these. Um, currently, I don't have all of them bought yet for Xbox One. I had them all on 360, but I got to rebuy them all again, which is really annoying. Uh, but, yeah, so pretty much it, just tell me a skin from one of the skin packs. If you're on PlayStation, you can still, you know, tell me a skin that you like. Uh, try to make it you know one that's not currently here but if you're on PlayStation try not to make it one that's like a PlayStation exclusive cuz I will you know not be able to build it normally what I do is I look in here and I look off the skin like if I look at this one for instance I'll do like a little turnaround of it and I'll try to build it so like you know any skin that's not here and is in one of the skin packs just tell me the skin and the skin pack and um, answer the question what you like and miss on the channel and you'll have a chance to win a spot right here I'll draw at random um, assuming I get three people that actually uh, want to uh, enter for over there hopefully you guys will, a lot of you guys will enter uh, it's really cool to have like a little spot here on my world and um, for right here all you have to do is answer the question you don't have to tell me anything else just answer the question so for the people who just answer the question I'll give them a chance to uh, be randomly drawn to be put in the hall of super friends and for the people who uh, actually want their skin put here they tell me the skin and the skin pack and they have a chance of being put right here and like I said try not to make it a skin that's already here so I'll just give you guys another little show of the skins that are already here and um, yeah my goal is to kinda of have like a bunch of skins of my friends and you guys just kinda of like you know rows upon rows of skins and they're all different skins that's what I'm hoping for so that's why I don't want any that are uh, alike or the same so yeah that's pretty much it for this video guys I hope you guys all enjoyed if you did leave a like down below as well subscribe if you already haven't and, um, yeah, so be sure to enter the contest. Uh, you know, anyone can enter as long as you answer the question. Um, the reason I did the Hall of Super Friends as well is to feel like anyone's on PC or doesn't have uh, Minecraft on the console editions and they don't know the skins, they still have a chance of being, you know, uh, have their name here in my world. So uh, that's really cool. And, um, I've done this sort of thing before. I did it for like Hunger Games and stuff, and I've given away spots, you know, for people who win my Hunger Games. And I did another uh, contest where I gave away these three spots right here. So, um, you know, I, I can do these at any time. So even if you don't win this time, you could have a chance to win next time. So that's always fun. So anyway, guys, that is it for me. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Let me know what you thought of everything I talked about here today down in the comment section below. And um, yeah, anyway, guys, I am Bat Zero Six Seven, and I will see you guys all later. Peace out.